What's going on everyone? It's DV and we're back in Bed Wars. We're going to be doing a crazy cool build. I'm excited for this one. This is going to be a combination of a bit of obby, a bit of challenge, and a little bit of PvP mixed together. It's going to be really cool. We are building the Temple of Doom. That's right. It sounds ominous, right? And it should be. It should be ominous because it is. So yeah, we're going to be doing some really, really cool builds in this one. If you haven't seen my other two videos with different builds, I had to, I actually made a Sniper Towers build. I also did a King of the Hill build, which was really cool we actually you know played with my clan on my discord server tons and tons of fun you can check those videos out i will link them in the description so you can check those builds out they're really really cool like i said but today we're going to be doing something even better i think this one's going to be probably one of the best ones i've done out of these other two just because i'm learning a lot and finally we get we can actually do like an obby kind of troll obby if you did not know bed wars does have custom maps now a lot of people are still learning about that so what you can do it's not custom matches it's maps custom maps that are shareable so check this out so if you go to custom matches you go to here and there's map saves so you can actually save your map so i've done a king of the hill map i've also done sniper towers we're gonna make a third one because i have one more empty slot here and then after this i'm gonna have to use an alt so you're gonna start seeing alt maps i'm gonna see if um, they're ever going to increase this like as a game pass that'd be really cool i would definitely buy that really really fast even if it's just like paper slot or something i'd do it so we're gonna go and make this i was thinking about making this one because it's temple of doom I don't want too many players, okay? I don't want like a ton of players in here where it's like super, super sweaty, but I do want it to be fairly competitive. So I'm thinking about making this another duels map because duels are just a lot of fun because you can still scale it. You could have, essentially it's like, it's like a smaller 30 v 30, right? So we're gonna do duels and I like the size of this map. So where we gotta put our temple, I'm thinking about putting it here because it's a smaller area. I can build a lot more there. Glacier's too cold looking. I like volatile, but runes makes a whole lot of sense um, because I've got all this space. Volatile is kind of cool though, because I can make some really interesting like height differences here. I don't know. Yeah, we'll, we'll go do runes. We're going to do runes. So let's go ahead and start that. By the way, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. All right. So we're going to go ahead and go blue for now. We don't have to worry about our join code. So here's what we're going to do. First of all, we always need to get our tools. So I always get like pickaxe, spawn, balloon. And also you could just type in slash I. I always type in spawn because it's just feels better, but slash I you can use. And there's our telepearls. All right. First things first, we do need to make a bridge. We're going to make it out of bedrock. I like bedrock. It's a cool block. Okay. It's a cool block. All right. Plus only hosts can break it, which is really nice. So we're just going to build to center for both of these, though I may make a slightly different entrance when I'm done here. I'm kind of thinking we might want to build up, up here and make the temple entrance on both sides, like up there. I'm kind of liking that better. So why don't we do that? I think it's kind of a little inspiration I'm getting here. So we're going to do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight nine and ten we're gonna go up yeah it's like I, it's like I, I exactly know what i'm doing right it's almost like i make it sound like i know exactly what we're doing part of content creation all right so what we're gonna do for this is um i think what i'm gonna i'm gonna get rid of that bridge in a little bit but for now i want this to be like a bridge into the temple and we only want to do like five out like that and so we're gonna have to do the same thing on both sides because i don't want to like lose track of this because it's a pain to replicate if you don't do it now because that's what happened with my sniper battles um video it is um, I forgot what I did. And so I had to go back and forth and reference. And it was really annoying. All right, so we got that. And then we're going to do, we'll do three. And it's going to be five out. And by the way, if you want to do my build, like do do your own version of it, go for it. That's why I make these. So I made this one five across or three across rather and five deep. Okay, so now I'm going to get rid of this bridge. Might as well. And now we're going to spawn a bunch of magma and fit of that. Now we're going to create a, like basically a magma pile. I might kill myself a couple times on accident. So under um, host panel, because there's a bunch of generators over there, we're going to go ahead and turn on ignore. So we're removing the build restricted regions. What that does is it lets you build in areas you shouldn't be able to build. So like if there's generator protected areas, like I can put a block on top of the generator and it's going to let me do it. Whereas without that setting, you can't do that. So what we're going to do is we're going to block this area off. This is going to be our lava pond pool. It's not a pond. Okay. No one's ever called a lava pool a pond. That's just weird. Only DB does that. Okay. We're just going to block all this stuff because we don't want people seeing that there's lava in here or magma from a distance. And um, just so you know, just a reminder, that these map tools are kind of in beta. They don't really list it as beta, but I'm going to say that for them because there's been lots of issues. And so I don't want you to be like all bummed out if something doesn't work fully, okay? It's just, that's how that's how it goes when they're, this is new. It was kind of rushed for us. We got we to gotta give the devs a little bit of a break. All right, so I want this to look pretty cool. So what we're going to do now is we are going to build a shell around this because this is looking like kind of stone mixed in with things. Don't really like that. So we're going to go and fill this in real quick so you don't see the stone. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go in free cam mode, make sure I select the block I 
want. We're just gonna use FreeCam. That way we can build on the outside here without having to worry about restrictions. If you didn't know you could do this, now you know. All right, now it's time to actually fill this in with the lava. I'm not looking forward to it because lava is tricky, man, because the colliders are really big on magma, like really big. So you don't wanna like mess up and get killed because you were too close to it. Again, minimalistic on the blocks, only place what you need to place or else it's gonna lag everyone. So the reason why I'm doing this is we want players to fall into my lava traps. One thing you wanna do is also give yourself clingy too in case you die, at least you can keep your items. If you die, then at least you respawn with them. You don't have to keep spawning them in, especially when you're dealing with the magma, you're gonna, you're probably gonna die. You're gonna forget, you're gonna get oofed. Um, at one point with PVP toggle, you know, magma, you could turn off PVP and it would actually not kill you, but then they fixed that. Cause that was a bug and I died. Of course I died. Hey, look at my magma, it's looking pretty good though. I got lazy, but look, I still have it. So you just type in enchant clingy two again. Oops, I didn't do it right. Clingy two, there we go. So if it happens again, at least you get all your items back. You don't have to keep like spawning them in. That'd be annoying. Like I said, you probably will get oofed. These things will get you. It hurts. All right, there we go. So we got our lava in. Now what we need to do is finish up our walls here. Um, and then we're gonna create a floor. So the idea here is some of these are gonna be traps. Some of them are just gonna straight up fall in. It's gonna be pretty cool. So let's get these up a little bit more. Now, one thing I forgot to do is um, set the bed breaks to infinite. So if you die, you can lose all your, um, all your stuff. So make sure you save and recreate and then continue where you were. So that's what I'm gonna do right now because I don't wanna risk losing everything. So we're gonna go and save, click that. We'll wait for it. It takes about a minute and then we're gonna recreate. All right, we're gonna lobby. All right, before I forget this time, we're gonna put deathmatch to infinite seconds. There we go. Now the entrance is gonna be pretty small. We'll do like a big entrance at first, but then because I mean, it's gotta be a, it's gonna be a really tall map. So it's kind of maze-like as well, but first we gotta go down. So you can choose right, left, or straight. If you go to the right, we should make it an immediate drop. And the key here is because they can see the lava, get some smoke blocks. So just do that so that they see that and they drop down. They won't see the lava. So they'll fall right into it. All right, so there's the lava there. And then on the left one, we're gonna make it so they do something similar. It's a bit of a maze. Then I'm going to make them go up a little bit and then they're going to fall down in this, this spot right here. All right. So if they, if they keep going, they're going to fall down in this and they can't get out. There's no way out of that. They got to reset. And then from here, you have to go up and then we're going to make two hallways. Now I'm going to do a little bit of randomness on each side because if people get switched to a different team, they're going to have a slightly different path, right? So I don't, I, I want them to think that the right side is bad when it's actually good. That's how troll I am. All right. I love these smoke blocks. They're so good. All right. So this is like the hardest like start and then and we're going to get, it's going to get crazy in a second. So we'll build some walls in a little bit. For now, I just want to see our pads. Now we got to go up. So we'll do the same thing we did before. You can either go straight, you can go this way, or you can go this way. This way is going to have Teslas zapping people, but you can still get through it. You just got to go quick. This is going to be a bit troll. I'm going to make you think this is a deadly path by putting these here. So you see this in front of you and you don't want to go down there. But the reality is you need to make a right and it's two blocks like that. So you see that and you're probably going to turn a right instead. Yeah. So if you run too fast, so you kind of have to like corner it and not hit that. So that's going to discourage you, but this is the right path here. Okay, this is looking good. This is looking good. So let's get our Teslas in. Five Teslas. That's going to shred someone going down the wrong path. All right, so I'm going to start securing the bottom here. We're just going to finish this up so we can get some walls in. All right, so this side is dark, dude. Look how dark that is. Oh my gosh, this is scary, actually. You can't even see the smoke block. You can on um, the video, but inside the game itself, it's way darker because I lighten the video up so you can actually see. But in here, oof, it's super dark. So I got like the first floor done and we got to do the second floor and then the final third floor. So let me do the outside real quick. So this is going to be the entrance here. I think I should get some like red blocks or something. Let's use like red wool. Actually not red wool. There's another block I can use. All right. For these sides here, I'm just going to use crash because it looks pretty cool. It's kind of like a pinkish block. We'll do this for the bridge entrance just like that. That looks pretty cool. I'm so scared coming in here. Like I'm actually scared of my own map. That's a good sign, right? I'm legit. I'm not, I'm not even joking. I don't want to die because I got all these blocks on me. First level done. This took me so long. I've been, I've been doing, I've been working on this for well over an hour. So now what I need to do, I need to work on the next floor. So this is the Tesla path, or they can go straight this way. Kind of want to dump them in the lava. So let's let's send them this way. Dude, this is such a scary, scary map. Like I am legit terrified of falling. Let's do this so they can't exactly hop out and they have to fall to their death. This is such a troll map. I love it. So my hope is they freak out. They rush through here. They're trying to get away from them and they run straight into magma blocks or just one magma block. Oh, in the ground, in the ground, even better. And let's put it like, let's put it, oh, smoke blocks. So they run right over the smoke blocks, dude. Oh, that's so good. I wonder on this one, if you put magma blocks in corners, would it kill you? Oh, that's a clever check. Let's see if it does. That would be so troll. All right, let's test it. Oh, it does. 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 Oh my gosh. New troll. Oh my gosh. I can't believe that worked. I don't even know what to do with this information right now. I think we're going to, we might have to reserve it for 2.0. I'm not sure. Let me see. Dude, we can't even see in there. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to make it so they have to actually land.
and beneath. So most players are going to be afraid of doing what we need to do, but you need to drop down right here. And then what I think what I'll do is I'll do a teleportal. I mean a teleporter, um, but we need to do like right here and then we'll put it like right here. So we'll make it like they got to jump kind of far like that. And this teleporter will take them to the top of the temple. All right, that, that works. That works pretty good. Okay, so now what we need to do is cover this up. It's going to be so dark. And now we have the fun chore of making the temple. So what we need to do is go up right here and we're going to do similar to what we did in the last video that I did, which was the King of the Hill. We're basically just creating another pyramid. All right, so that is the progress on the temple. Now I just need to do a little bit more for it. I need to make it look a little bit more Mayan. So how we're going to do that is we're going to go straight up on these, about three blocks. Then we're going to go, oh, we're at we're at the top. We're at the very top. This is the top of the map. Yeah, I think it looks cooler if I trim it with the crush. All right, so I want to do one more thing that I think will just give it like a really cool look is I think on the, the corners here, I'm going to make all of these crush as well. I think I'll just add a little touch to the whole temple design. Hopefully it works. All right, so we got the completion done. I think we're ready to go. I think this is a pretty cool temple. I hear, here's the thing. I know you can't actually see inside the temple because that's so dark. So I'm going to switch over to a really, really bright screen for a moment. It's going to blind you. I'm sorry in advance, but I wanted you to be able to see the inside. So I'm going to go and transition this over. And now you're going to see like a really, really bright version of my screen because it gets really dark inside. So I'm going to just free cam this, give you a little tour inside. So you can actually see a lot easier, right? It's like really washed out, but this is how dark it is, how dark it is. And um, you got the Teslas down here. It's going to be really hard for you to see though. Look at this. It's just really dark. So we're going to actually experience this. This is the inside right here. You see it's pretty wide open and that's why we need the teleporter. So the teleporter will come up here and that's basically the end result. So let's go and get my clan in here. Let's let's see let's see if anyone can get through it. I don't know. It's going to be pretty tough. The other thing I'm going to do though is I'm going to break bed so they only get one try. We're going to see if someone's really lucky and actually makes it through. All right. So we're going to go and turn off PVP here. We're going to turn off bed breaking, host only. I'm going to break theirs. And then block breaking, we're going to turn off host only. Uh, we got to set off. We got to turn off all generators. Got to turn off all kits, turn off all items. They don't get anything. Here's how we do it. So there is actually a command. So if I want to move all spectators to a particular team, I can. So what we're going to do is we're going to set all team members from spectator to blue. We're also turning on PVP so they can die. All right. Now we get to watch them die. Here they go. They don't know what to do, dude. Are they really scared? Dude, it's so rough in there right now. I can't even see. Let people go in first. Dark moment. Yeah. Deep dark. Dude, they're scared. They don't know what to do, dude. <laughs> Look at them. Apparently it does reach them. Oh, that guy just fell to his death. Oh no. I don't know if we're going to get a winner. I think this is a little hard. I can set them all. If all of them die, I'll, I'll respawn them all. But this is going to be weird because you're basically watching like their name tags. Look at them scared, dude. Are anyone rock paper? Bro dead, dude. They're scared. Okay. They could actually get through. I'm going to have to go bright mode for you so you can see. But you see they're, they're too afraid to go across. I mean, they're afraid of the, they're afraid of the Teslas. They don't know what to do, dude. This is the funniest map I've ever done. This one's going straight. They don't know where to go, dude. Some people have gone right and they've died. <laughs> I said, are you scared? And they're like, we are scared. They just got to run through this. They just got to run. Go run. Run through it. Maybe I'll give them all. Let me give them all some extra health. I give them extra health so they don't get zapped. They can't see, dude. Oh, there they go. There they go. <laughs> oh my God, dude. They are so scared. I've never had, I have to tell you, I've never had a single match where I've had players this scared of progressing. It's so dark for them. Like you can see how dark it is. Like this is fully, like this is brightened big time. There's no light in here. There it goes. I don't think they realize they need to jump. There's a step. I told them there's a step they're not jumping on and they, they're finally figuring it out. <laughs> See, it's at the very end and they got to make a left. All right, I got to respawn them all. <laughs> I just told them, welcome to Temple of Doom, dude. Dude, they're they're so scared of these Teslas. I might have to lighten them up. Apparently, this is harder than I thought. They're getting shredded by my Teslas. We'll take we'll take out, like, I just don't, I, I think once they figure it out, it's really easy. All right, I'm giving everyone infinite health. It doesn't help them with lava though, but that'll help them with the Teslas. Okay, they're making progress. They are making progress. Someone just fell. <laughs> Oh my God, dude, that's hilarious. This is the hardest map they've ever been on. I might have to give them some light. <laughs> he just fell. He just fell. <laughs> oh my God, that's so funny. <laughs> they don't know where to go, dude. Don't walk there. <laughs> They did not sign up for this. There they go, dude. They're making it. You found it. <laughs> oh my God. This is just the beginning. I think this might be the hardest side. The blue side is the hardest. Oh, they found the step. They found the step. They found a step. Yeah, they got to go straight now. <laughs> Here, I'm going to respawn everyone. Dude, we got we got some we got some players that are together right now. They're making it work. Yeah, they're doing it right. Oh yeah, they got to jump because they see the lava now. They got to jump across. <laughs> He's all, I'm scared. <laughs> Same. <laughs> oh no. They're, they're really close to the ledge. Get off that ledge, dude. You're, you're going to fall into the lava. There you go. Don't fall. Can we make that? <laughs> There's a hole we jump again. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. He's, he just died, dude. There's his body. 
no. Oh my god, dude. Hold on. I gotta I gotta respawn him. <laughs> got me so what does that mean? Dude, that is so funny. And oh, she fell to her death. Oh no. Hey, they're figuring it out though. They are figuring it out. This is brutal. Bacon, we shall do this. I don't know if this was worth $10 Roblox gift card. Maybe it was. Yeah, they gotta go across here. They're really close. Magma. This is one of the hardest maps you're gonna ever navigate. I definitely need to do this on my stream. So here's the here's the area they need to go up. They just need to go to the right and then up the stairs. I wonder if they'll figure it out. Oh, he died. Oh, he jumped down there. Yeah, you can't see that. This is what you're seeing. This is what everyone else is seeing. This is what my filter, this is without. It's so much brighter. Man, he's gotta, he's gotta not go down that way. There's actually a corner. They need a, I think it's, they need to hook a right if I recall. All right, so I spawned them all on my side because it's slightly different. Let's see how they do. A little bit easier, still difficult. All right, so they found the magma bridge. Dude, I don't think we're gonna have anyone win. They're struggling. Oh no, they're gonna get stuck. That's the wrong path. <laughs> dude, this is so bully. This is so bully, dude. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I just asked how, how bright are their screens. They said they have Discord bright mode on right now. Okay, I think some of these are making progress. I think they're making progress. That's some progress for sure. I might give them I might give them a little bit of light. I'm not sure. I might give them a little bit of light. But I mean, they're making progress. At least it seems like it. Here, I'm going to give them a little bit of light. All right, I just turned off PVP to make it a little easier for them. It, apparently, it's too hard. Apparently, it is too hard. This should make it a little bit easier. Ooh, someone, did someone really get up this far? Wait, did someone make it? Oh, they made it. Who made it first? Cash did. So apparently turning off PVP helped them a ton. I guess they're afraid of the Teslas, but um, I didn't see who came through first. So, and a bunch of people were claiming it. So we're going to have them do it through one more time. Oof, it was that. It was that DV. Who is that? Yeah, so DV Grimoire made it. Nice. GG's. I mean, all of them figured it out eventually. Did it again this side. I told them to do this side. Okay, somehow they're like speed running this. How are they speed running this? Dude, they figured it out. Oh, right. PVP. They cheated. They cheated, dude. They cheated. They cheated. We'll give this one to Grimoire though because Grimoire made it through first. Anyway, that was a lot of fun. I can't believe it, dude. It was so funny. Let me stop blinding you. It was so funny when they were like, I am so scared. They were freaking out just like I do. It's something It's something about like, man, not knowing where you're going. That's like, this was like the like back rooms for sure. Anyway, thanks so much for watching. If you want to see more videos like this one, let me know in the comments below. I will make this code shareable. So if you want to be able to play it yourself, I will show you right now. So here's the code for Temple of Doom. I will also include this in the description below. So if you want to check it out yourself, you can do so. So much fun. It is code P F F C V I Q P K J E L. Thanks again for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see y'all next time. Peace.